What's up friends, and welcome back. So for today we have yet another Mortal Kombat 11 video and for today's video we have a tweet by Ed Boon that suggests we may be getting our next combat pack reveal on December 10th at the Game Awards. But before we get into any of that, be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so I really really hope I'm wrong about this, but like I said, there's a tweet by Ed Boon that kind of points to us getting our next combat pack reveal on December 10th at the Game Awards. Now this is a tweet in question, and as you can see, it's just Ed Boon saying, love that animation, and retweeting the announcement for the Game Awards, which is on December 10th. Now, the main reason why I think that something of Mortal Kombat 11 is going to be revealed at this event is because, well, if you guys don't remember or don't know, two years ago, in 2018 at the Game Awards, was the first ever reveal and announcement for Mortal Kombat 11, the game. So, it would like kind of make sense that they reveal something else MK11 related at this year's Game Awards, but man, does it suck waiting this long. Like... It feels like I've been waiting a year for something to happen, guys. Now, I'm not saying it's official that something's going to be revealed from MK11. Maybe we get an Injustice 3 announcement at the Game Awards. I don't know, but it's definitely almost 100% likely that something is going to get revealed or announced at the Game Awards in December 10th. Now, like I said, guys, there's a high chance something will happen before that or that something that's not even MK11 related will be revealed at the events. But all we can do is keep our fingers crossed. And if you guys don't know, two days ago, Ed Boon said that clue number three was going to come out the next day, which would have been yesterday. And we really got nothing except for that tweet. So it kind of makes sense. But I don't know, guys. Anyways, let me know your thoughts and opinions and theories about that in the comment section down below. And for now, let's get to the comments of the day. So first up we have, Natara makes more sense according to his hints. Yeah, I've heard a lot of people say that Natara is actually the one that Edwin is hinting at with his teases and clues. I don't know how they got Natara from that. Like, I know people have found so many possible characters from the clues. I just don't even know what to believe anymore. Next up we have, I, I wish this wasn't fake. They are taking too damn long. Dude, tell me about it. That's exactly what I'm saying with the whole Game Awards thing. I hope we don't have to wait all the way to the end of the year. But at the, at the end of the day, who knows? And lastly, we have... Who would you want to combat pack to? Reptile or Quan Chi? Honestly, I think Quan Chi. Like, Reptile is cool and all, don't get me wrong. But Quan Chi, at least for me, seems like a more diverse character. He's like a bit funner to use. I don't know, he just seems a bit more versatile. Like he has more things, especially with his magic and all that. So I definitely, I would go with Quan Chi over Reptile. But anyway guys, let me know your thoughts on all this in the comment section down below. Other than that, thank you for watching. Be sure to stay subscribed for more videos just like this one. And peace.